K2-141b is an exoplanet that is 1.48 times more dense than Earth, located 202 light years away from Earth. In the Aquarius constellation, this exoplanet was discovered in 2018 by the Kepler Space Telescope. It circles the orange dwarf star named K2-141. K2-141b is a terrestrial exoplanet. Terrestrial meaning it is not made out of gas like Jupiter and is made out of rock like Earth or Mars. It is a super-Earth. Did you know that K2-141b rains rocks? These are five inconceivable facts about K2-141b. Number one, it is super hot and extremely cold. Astronomers think that K2-141b is, guess who the culprit is, tidally locked. Because it is astonishingly just about 665,000 miles or 1,070,213 kilometers away from the star it orbits. That is unimaginably close in space terms. It circles its star in just seven hours, which means that a year there is way less than one day on Earth. As I said a second ago, it is tidally locked, so one side is always facing its star and it's always day while the other is always turned away in complete darkness. The day side is baked up to an astounding 5,400 degrees Fahrenheit or 2,982 degrees Celsius. On that side, the surface is melted and is instead turned into molten lava. However, the night side of the exoplanet is the complete opposite of the day side. Always residing in pitch black darkness, receiving little heat, the night side is as cold as negative 328 degrees Fahrenheit or negative 200 degrees Celsius. Wow, a world of two extremes! Number two, it rains rocks there. Astronomers say that it pelts and rains rocks on K2-141b. How does this happen? Well, I'll explain. On the day side, the temperatures are so, so extreme that it evaporates the lava into its atmosphere. Then, winds carry the vaporized lava to the night side. The lava falls down and because of the cold temperatures, hardens while falling and becomes quartz pebbles. The rocks then splosh down. Now, even though the night side is cold, it still has a lava ocean like the day side. Both lava oceans are over 62 miles or 100 kilometers deep. After the rocks fall in the ocean, they turn into lava again and flow over to the day side and the process starts over. Number three, the atmosphere is really toxic. As I said before, the dayside temperatures are extremely sizzling and they evaporate lots of things. So it makes sense that K2-141b's atmosphere is made out of mineral vapor or evaporated lava or rock too. The chemicals that make up its atmosphere are silicon monoxide, sodium, and silicon dioxide. For comparison, Earth's atmosphere almost entirely consists of nitrogen and oxygen. So on K2-141b, you don't want to take a breather. Number four, the winds there are very strong and fast. 
Astronomers estimate that the winds on this exoplanet can reach incredible speeds. Up to 3,100 miles per hour, or 4,988 kilometers per hour. That's way faster than a plane or a hurricane, for example. And finally, number 5. K2-141b has an iron core. Astronomers theorize that K2-141b has an iron core. That's because the exoplanet is relatively dense. And if an exoplanet or planet is sort of dense, an iron core is likely the reason why. The iron core would be pretty similar to Earth's. Finally, one thing about this exoplanet that's similar to Earth. Unfortunately, like a lot of other facts, there's not a whole lot of info about the core. But hey, astronomers will probably discover something new about the core pretty soon. So, which fact did you like the best? Share please in the comment section below this video, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll, I will see you in my next video.